Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we're working on the light bulbs in our tail lights. This is going to be a simple video. Um, all you need is a 10 millimeter uh, wrench um, or socket. We're just going to use our little impact driver here, no problem. Um, you want to get the was HP 11 LEDs for both your turn signal and your brake light. And then you're going to need the, what are they called, HP 36 for your reverse lights. So let's get started. Hello and welcome to Midlife Crisis. My name is Aaron and I invite you to follow along with me and my son Austin on our journey as we build out a few camper vans and customize a new Toyota Tacoma into a beast. Then later in the year, we'll head out to Southeast Asia to ride a couple of adventure bikes through multiple countries, sharing the amazing experience with our viewers and ending our tour in Thailand. There, we will decide what to do next, maybe buy a sailboat and sail around the world. Who knows? So please hit subscribe and follow us on this adventure. Clay, you've got two bolts in here, one on the top, one on the very bottom. Take those out and then just pull your light out. Either use gloves or a towel, what have you, when you touch the light bulbs, the LEDs, because if you leave any oil or grease on them, it could um, cause the light to overheat and break. Um, so basically these two top ones, go ahead, pull the old one out with your hands. We're just gonna use these two. I grabbed it with my hand. Breaking my own rules. There we go. And you'll remember from the previous video, we wired the, uh, the reverse lights in the bumper to this here and piggybacked them. So this one's going to be a little bit more delicate. Getting it out of here. doesn't like me anymore. <laughs> Come on! Just they're tight. I need a screwdriver to pop it out. ours to come out. That one took a little wiggling to get in there. Turn it in. All right. Just slide it straight back in. So clips. Push it back. Get your screw started. Same thing on this side. Uh, 
and that's really it. There's not a whole lot to it. Um, we'll go ahead and take care of this on the other side and then we'll show you the results. Okay, so this is what the brake lights look like just on their regular on position. And there they are with the brake lights applied. Now let's look at it the other way around. Turn them off. Okay, so that's stock brake lights driving brakes. And there's the brakes. Go. And there is the stock reverse lights. The uh, lights look like standard. I had to put cloth over the uh, tail lights or the uh, license plate lights because they're so dang bright. Okay. So there's your brake lights. Okay. And there's your reverse lights. Holy crap. Well, okay, that's not fair because those are super bright. But let's look at these here. So they're not uh, as bright. Anyway, let's get back to our regular schedule program. Okay, so here's what they look like after we install the LED lights. This is just your uh, basic driving lights. Okay, there's your brake lights. Turn! Reverse! Still, that's way brighter than the other ones were. I know these, these bumper lights keep blinding everything. But uh, that's it, people. In the dark. Subscribe, like, follow the channel. I know this was a short one, but it's an easy one. So we'll see you.